Hi guys, it's Silvestre here. So welcome back to another apartment renovation video. And this time it's a teenager's apartment. So that's pretty cool. It was definitely very inspired by uh, the new Parenthood game pack. Since a lot of things that came with the pack are very centered around teens or look like decorations for a teenager or child's room, I thought that's what I would create. And I did think of it to be for a brother and sister um, living in this apartment. So there is two bedrooms and there's one bathroom, but honestly you could have, you don't have to have teens living in this apartment. If you wanted to have a family here, they would fit as well. Um, yeah, I thought that was a pretty fun idea to do and the teens that I imagine this apartment are kind of stereotypical boy and girl <laughs> teens is what I was thinking like um, the girls room I kind of created to be very girly with you know pinks and purples and I thought maybe she was a bit a uh, little bit artistic and so she has a uh, painting easel in there and I thought they were both into music and kind of like video games and just sort of having fun being teenagers and then the boy I thought that he was into uh, definitely into like sports and computers and I don't know just I had a very yeah very typical idea in mind for some teenagers living here and yeah had lots of fun decorating it but I think this apartment would also be really great if you want to do a big sister challenge or a big brother challenge or a runaway teen or something like that maybe a pregnant teen because you could turn the boys bedroom into a nursery pretty easily it is a lot smaller than uh, what I had be the girls bedroom so yeah lots of fun and I'm definitely still enjoying this new pack it's about uh, three or so days now after having this pack so yeah lots of lots of fun <laughs> I think everybody else is enjoying it as well because I've been seeing you know tons of awesome builds and things and so I was also thinking about doing a creative sim I was thinking about doing my teen self as a sim I thought that'd be kind of fun um, yeah, so I don't know, maybe I'll do that. I was trying to think what items we have in the game or items that I have uh, that are custom content that would have been similar to things that I owned as a teen. I mean, I wasn't very edgy or super like stylish, so I would be kind of a typical looking teen, but I still thought it would be fun to do anyhow. So if you guys are interested in seeing that, you can of course let me know in the comments because yeah, that'd be pretty helpful. Um, and something I did use a lot in this apartment is debug option or options, <laughs> debug objects, uh, just to kind of get a little bit more clutter and stuff for the apartment. And mostly, I wanted it for the soda cans and the headphones and like the remote, just little electronics and these uh, uh, what do you call it, pen pal postcard things. Um, but yeah, so this apartment is actually really expensive for being a teenager apartment, but I mean that's just because there is so, so much clutter, so you know, it adds up unfortunately, but oh well. Um, so it's like 40 something thousand simoleons, so it's about twice as much as it should be, I think, for a starter apartment. I mean, I'm not exactly sure how much it cost moving in. I didn't actually check, but I'm not sure if it uploads to the gallery the same that it would cost for your sim to move in because since it's uploaded as a room I think it's a little bit different since they like I don't know it might not be if you if you put it in this apartment it might be a little bit different than 40,000 not exactly sure um but yeah so I'm just putting lots of clutter around oh and this basketball hoop it works I did play test it they can play basketball um, they didn't give me the option to shoot like far away shots it was just close shots so I don't know if that was like a skill thing or a distance thing I think it was probably a skill thing um, but yeah and they were able to get inside the door as well I didn't create any sims for it I just had like my playtester sim come here but uh, yeah it worked really well and I tried to do a mixture of kind of boy and girl stuff and also add in stuff that looked a little bit more little kiddish because I wasn't sure if they'd both be like you know 17 18 or whatever maybe one of them's maybe the one's 19 and the other one's like 14 or something maybe it's like you know the big sister with her little brother living here or vice versa something like that but um yeah so I tried to do a mixture of boy girl stuff and yeah little like sentimental items like the popsicle stick flower I just really like that item I think it's one of the cutest things that came with the parenthood stuff is just it looks like I don't know something that a little kid made from hand is I, it's so cute <laughs> but yeah and tried to add 
lots of just kind of color. I didn't do so much color on the walls. I mean, right now I just have them white and I do add in a couple accent walls, but I try to not do the walls overly colorful or any of the like kind of secured structured, uh, you know, the things that would be there when you first moved into the apartment. So like the cabinets and stuff and the refrigerator. I was originally going to go with red with the refrigerator and the stove, but just didn't look quite right with me, at least with the direction I was going with like the colors and things. So yeah, but here I'm adding just a few colorful things. And now that wallpaper I just realized is from the bowling stuff pack. And I didn't try to only do city living and parenthood, but I tried to keep it mostly around that stuff. I mean, there's some stuff from like the kids room stuff pack and probably, I, I know there's a couple stuff from outdoor retreat. And, I don't know, probably a bunch of other packs, but it's not like the main core of the apartment. The main core of the apartment, I really did try to keep with just the parenthood and city living expansion pack and game pack. That way, if you at least have those, this apartment should look pretty similar. But I mean, as I mentioned, I think maybe two, three videos ago, I want to start doing more base game apart or not apartments, but base game builds with just base game or maybe one or so pack. But um, yeah, I really want to see what you guys are thinking about with that. So if you have any suggestions or if you have a limited number of packs, tell me which ones you have so I kind of have an idea of where to start or what people would want to see. But I'm definitely gonna be doing a base game only build probably next week sometime. Um, yeah, I probably won't get much building done over the weekend, but when the week starts up again, I should have time to do that. And I also have a collab coming up and hopefully more collabs in the future because I had to put off collabs for a while because of my, you know, my, I knew I was going to have a break and didn't want to have that interfere with any collabs that, you know, people were planning or be too much of a burden. <laughs> um, so yeah, I have one coming up hopefully sometime this month, maybe next month, depending on when the last person gets their part done. But yeah, I look forward to that and hopefully some more collabs as well. Um, and yeah, if you have any suggestions on things you want to see, that would be very helpful since I have lots of time to build right now since I'm in between working and school, you know, school just ended for me, I did graduate. And now I'm looking for a job, but who knows how long that'll take. Hopefully not too long, but the market is pretty slim right now for what I've been looking at anyways. So um, yeah, keeping my fingers crossed though for something good to come up or something that I qualify for, or I don't know. I've been applying for things that I'm like super underqualified for. Um, so we'll see. I mean, there's just not a whole lot, at least entry positions available right now. So we will we'll see if something comes available, but in the meantime, I'll just build and hopefully do some volunteering at the zoo because that would just be ugh, so great. Um, I'm probably going to go there tomorrow. I don't think um, they'll be open when I go to the lake today. But, um, but anyway, so yeah, this is the girls' room and it's bigger room. But I just really had fun trying to make it a little bit girly and a little bit kind of hippie. This is probably the teen room I would have liked because... I was quite the tomboy when I was a little kid, a little bit more girly, kind of hippie when I was like preteen to a teen. And now as an adult, I don't know, I'm just a mixture of all of my previous selves, I guess, but I never had too much of a edgy or dramatic style. It's always been pretty, pretty much the same. Um, but yeah, I just like this room. Probably wouldn't have gone as girly in my teenage years. I don't know. I can't really remember, that was a long time ago. <laughs> But anyways, this is going to be the boys' room, and originally I was going to make it a little bit more little kiddish, but decided to make it a little bit more adult looking, a little bit more older teen. So, but like I said earlier, you could have it be like, you know, a younger teen and an older teen, or, you know, a little kid or a baby or a family or whatever you want to do in this apartment. But, um, yeah, it's what I had in mind for them, and I didn't do too many Actually, no, there's a couple skill building items. I was going to say there's not too many, but there's two guitars in this apartment and they each have their own computer, which is really nice and something else. Oh, the art easel in the girls' bedroom. So yeah, they do have some things to kind of get some skills done, but I kind of, I don't know, didn't want to do too many like bulky, expensive objects since these are teenagers. They're probably not going to have a whole lot of things, but I mean, they do have computers, which is nice. <laughs> But yeah, hopefully you guys like this apartment. You'll have to let me know in the comments what you guys 
do think of it, that would be very much appreciated. <laughs> um, but yeah, I feel like this commentary has actually been harder than my last one that I did. And my last one was the first one that I did coming back after two weeks. <laughs> and so I don't know why this one would be harder than that one. But I, I actually tried to record this three times previous. And then I took like a two hour break and then came back to it now. So I actually did the whole thing. <laughs> I'm pretty proud. Um, but anyway, so I just finished up the brother's bedroom. And then I think I just do a couple more finishing touches. I wanted to add, um, I think, some lights into the sister's bedroom. Because, yeah, I love those little fairy lights. Really happy they added those. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And please leave any comments or suggestions you have. And I'll talk to you guys soon. All right, bye.